Hey, what's going on guys? Austin here and welcome to my uh, catch-up video for the Trailblazer League series that I've been doing. Uh, I haven't uploaded in a few days, I think it's about four or five days now, but uh, there is a good reason for that. I have been doing my exams. Uh, I've just finished them now, finished them yesterday, so today I'm going to start playing again. But this episode up until about halfway through might seem a little bit um, weirdly uh, structured just because I tried to record clips as best as I could whilst I was studying and just sort of AFKing and doing a few bandos trips here and there, but um, it might not seem uh, as well structured as the other ones. Uh, about halfway through though, it should uh, become a little bit uh, better and yeah, hopefully you still enjoy. Okay, God Sword Shard 3, hell yeah. Our first, well, our first unique from God Wars at least. Oh man, that's, that's pretty cool to see. KC4. Um, I've only just reset my loot trackers literally just then, so uh, yeah, we'll see what else we get from here onwards. <laughs> God Sword Shard 3 on the fourth kill, nice. No way, no, no way, no way, no way, no way, no way, no way. No way! <laughs> KC5, you're kidding me, you are kidding me. That is, I am, I don't even know what to say. <laughs> oh, I better not die, actually. Oh my god. Okay. Sick. God Sword Shard 1. Nice. Okay, one more shard and a hilt and we're good to go. <laughs> oh my god, my luck here is actually just so crazy right now. Okay. <laughs> That's two tassies. Kind of sad, uh, but at least I have something to put in Death's Coffer for when I die eventually. I haven't died this whole time yet. Ever since I made the account, I haven't died yet, so... Yeah, it'll be quite the day when I actually do. Anyway, another Tassies. Very nice. Okay, that's my first no kill. No. Okay, that's my first no food kill. Uh, I'm getting a lot better at flicking uh, the mage minion. I'm not doing the range range minion yet, but I'll probably learn that eventually. But my, uh, yeah, flicking the mage minion makes such a massive difference. I'm, I mean, I guess I got lucky in this kill that I didn't take many range hits, but uh, yeah, it's Nice to see some progress at least. And that's a three kill trip as well, which is more than what I would have thought I would get within this kill count. Progressing very, very well with learning the uh, flicking method, so that's nice. Uh, hopefully we can finish Bandos pretty quickly though. Now that I've got two Tassies, I'm thinking my luck is gonna be pretty decent, unless I only get Tassets from now on, which would be unfortunate. But yeah, I've got a good feeling about it. I wish I'd recorded that, but that is botanist in action. I just managed to make all these super restores with one set of red spider's eggs. I am loving this relic. And that's another God Sword Shard 3. This time I got one off of Grador. So, yeah, that's the first shard off the boss at least. 32 KC now. Uh, first thing I've seen in a few kills, but we're still doing very well. And another God Sword Shard 2 from the Ranger, which is quite... Crazy. I haven't added... Wait, no. Hang on. Is that the last one I need? I'm not even sure if that's the last one I need. I'll check when I go to the bank. I'm just going to do one more kill real quick. Okay, that was actually a really good trip. Uh, I think I got like three kills, so pretty decent. Uh, I had a ton of food left as well, but I ran out of prayer, so let's see if this is the last shard. It's looking like it is. So we have an, all the shards we need for a blade. We just need to get the uh, smithing level. I think it's like 80 smithing or something. So that's really nice to, uh, to have in the bank. Yeah, so 80 smithing for the God Sword Blade. As soon as we get the hilt now, we can grind out 80 smithing and get ourselves a BGS. I think if I do actually get the hilt like pretty soon, I will do that and then go for um, weapon specialist instead of the uh, leeching attacks uh, relic, whatever it is, draining strikes. I think I actually will go with weapon specialist. Uh, that's if I get the hilt uh, within the next, I don't know, before I get bored, basically. So, chances are we're gonna be going weapon specialist. I know I keep flip-flopping, but uh, it's I feel like BGS is just gonna be way too good at so many things apart from, obviously it's not gonna be great at TOB, but uh, yeah, we will see what we will see. Hey, we got the Bando's boots. Okay, not the one that I wanted first, but at least we got the boots. Now we just need the chest plate and the hilt and we are out of here. Oh man, I was actually, literally gonna stop at 45 kills tonight but I thought now nah, I'll go to I'll go to 50 and it has paid off 
Uh, I think these are better at bandos actually, but still very nice to have. I'm not sure if that counts towards the set for the task, like you need to equip band full bandos, but uh, it's still very nice to have. Okay, so apparently I've somehow just caught this. I didn't even realize I was this close to 99, but there we go. First 99 on the account, 99 cooking. Just got it through uh, just cooking stuff so that I can go back to bandos ASAP. Uh, probably going to go and bust out 99 fishing now. Uh, I'm going to go grab the cooking cape as well so that I no longer burn sharks. That was the main reason why I wanted to get 99 first um, off of grand ones because now I don't burn sharks if I get the cooking cape, which is going to be very nice. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to go get the cooking cape and then go and get 99 fishing. Okay, so it's been a couple of days since I last recorded a clip. Uh, I finished my exams yesterday uh, and I've just been playing for about half an hour today. Just finished cooking up all my sharks that I caught, so I have a thousand sharks now, which is going to be very nice for doing some bossing. Um, but from this point onwards, I'm going to be working on getting my next relic unlocked. Uh, I did want to see if I could finish bandos without doing this, but I also think that it's going to be very much worth unlocking my next relic, whether it be weapon specialists or draining strikes, just for doing the God Wars bosses. I probably should have done it before, but I was just too keen to get stuck into it. But now that I have more time, uh, I think I'm just going to go ahead and get this last 1200 points uh, and then go back to God Wars when I have my last relic unlocked. So yeah, uh, time to go and start working on that. Okay, so there is a task for opening the crystal chest. So let's just use these couple of keys that we've managed to get throughout our journey so far. So there's the task, 50 points, 100 coal with that dragonstone and a spinach roll. Okay, not the best, but also the 100 coal is probably gonna be pretty nice once we start doing smithing, so not complaining. And these two dragonstones will be used for our upgrades later on. Whoa, uh, Miss Battle Staff. I just came here to get some more gold so that I can do a couple more tasks that are gonna take me quite a bit of money. Uh, and we managed to get ourselves a Mist Battle Staff. Not what we're looking for, but it is still a unique. We also defeated 50 superior slay creatures, which means that I now don't have to do a lot of the tasks that I was planning on doing, which is going to be very nice. Actually, I probably don't even need to be here now because of that. So I'm just going to quickly have a think and see if I need to actually be here anymore. Oh, you hate to see it. Another Miss Battle Staff. Goddamn. Ooh, a Dark Mystic Rope Top as well. Nice. No, I missed it. Oh, okay, well, there's 99 strength anyway. Okay, so I decided not to go for the Onyx because uh, I got that 99 strength, so that put me really close to actually getting my relic. Uh, plus, I don't really need the Onyx right now. I don't have the crafting level anyway, so I'd have to grind that out. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and buy the Obsidian Cape first. That is 100 points. Okay, so it turns out I miscalculated slightly. I'm 1.4k away, but that's fine. I'm not gonna bother wasting my Toggle yet. Uh, I'm just gonna go and do two easy tasks real quick and bang it, those last couple of points out. Okay. So this should be the final relic unlocked after this guy dies, which he doesn't seem to want to. Okay, there we go. Final task completed. That is enough points to unlock the next relic. <laughs> and I have done a lot of thinking, a lot of thinking, and I've been going back and forward on these two training strikes and weapon specialist, but I've come to an idea and a conclusion. I'm going to be going draining strikes on this account and then I'm going to be making another account and go weapon specialist because I really want to use the special attack relic but on this account draining strikes is just going to be so much more useful for me. I'm going to be learning TOB so that's going to be really helpful there and when I think about it this is only really good for ranged because you get the blowpipe, you get dark bow and then obviously you still get your melee stuff but you can use this whilst you're hunting for your, your hilts. But if I go this now, I'm still gonna have to go and get the hilts and the blades to be able to use it. But this is just gonna be helpful the whole time. So yeah, that's pretty much my idea. I'm gonna make an alt account uh, pretty soon, probably in the next couple of days. Um, I might make another couple of videos on that, but it won't be taking over from this account anytime soon, or if ever really. Um, but yeah, I am planning on doing that. So draining strikes unlocked. Now we can restore our prayer whilst we are just attacking something. So it's time to go to Bandos. Let's go to Bandos. All right, I've just come back to Bandos. I haven't drank a single prayer potion or eaten a single food since I started that last kill. First kill was a bit rough, but that mo that kill just then used basically nothing. 
And I got a god sword shard too, so that's nice. Okay, there it is. 100 kills. Haven't had anything since the shard that I just showed you before. Um, hopefully... I won't go dry here. It'd be it'd be nice to get it all done in the in the recommended kill count, which is like one two seven, I think. But you know how it goes. I might end up going like two hundred and fifty dry or something. So I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Oh my god! Let me just pop this open real quick and show you this name and this item. Uh. <laughs> Well, we're waiting on the hilt now, so I guess we're going to stay, but I now have full bandos. I just need to go put on the boots and I can get the, uh, the task done. Oh my god. I am so fried right now from just concentrating on, on this as much as I can. I can't even do commentary properly. Oh my god. Oh, finally. I actually look like a normal player, not just a noob. Holy shit. Okay, nice. Okay, there we go. That's my... One of our first master tasks completed. Equip full Bandos armor. Oh, I'm looking pretty pimp right now. Not gonna lie. Look at this. Oh, I'm so glad. I'm so glad I finally got it. I thought I was gonna go dry forever. I mean, I do still have to get the hilt, but I'm still within the, the kill count for the projected rates. So, oh, I'm so, I'm so buzzed. Okay, well, there's the first, well, the second dupe, I guess. We got the dupe tassets early, and now we have this. So, another pair of boots. Not ideal, but there you go. Hopefully, the hilt's coming soon. Still within the kill count, so we might get lucky. Woo! Okay, there it is. Bando's completed. Oh, my God. Under the kill count, I looked it up, and it's a 1 in 169. So, I've actually done really, really well. Oh, my God. It's actually done. I can finally get this video out. Oh, and I might as well do the outro now because that's it. Uh, thank you for watching. Sorry for the delay on the uh, episode, but obviously, as I've mentioned many times before, I had stuff that I had to do. The episode should be back now either daily or once every two days, depending on how lucky I get uh, at bosses and stuff. Uh, in the next episode, I'm probably just going to be going for the 80 smithing, obviously, so that I can get my Bando's Godsword built. Uh, and then I'm going to be heading to Zamorak. I'm going to be trying to get a Zamrak spear from there. And then once I get a Zami spear, I'll be heading straight to Otto to get it turned into a Hasta. And then I'm going to go and do some Cerberus. So that's probably what's going to be happening in the next episode. So please make sure that you uh, subscribe or whatever. Do whatever you need to do so you can see the next episode. Uh, and yeah, hopefully I'll see you there. So yeah, hopefully have a good day and I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.